As an industry, we've been hit hard by the recent events in our world, but it has given us an opportunity to stop and take stock of how we can plan things a little differently going forwards when looking at our total programme of events. The 17 United Nations Sustainable Development Goals, also known as SDGs, provide an excellent framework to help transform our industry, our world and improve people's lives. So what can we do when going forwards? Well, Siebent's always said it's one step at a time when it comes to sustainability, you can't do it all. And planners and suppliers should select the SDGs that are most relevant to their events and then commit to action which will help them realise these goals. The funny thing is, your events probably already contribute to a multitude of SDGs, but unless these contributions are recorded, tracked and reported, the consequences of them going unnoticed could result in the stagnation or decline of the industry as a whole. So if your event programme has a donation programme, you're already contributing to SDG number one, which is no poverty. If you donate waste food to local charities, you're contributing to SDG number two, which is zero hunger. If your meetings agenda includes elements of well-being, you're contributing to SDG three, which is good health. And if your conference programme has a policy for ensuring speaker diversity, you're already contributing to SDG five, which is gender equality. So event planners can easily equate existing activity and commit to accelerated action on each and every one of these SDGs. But unless it's actioned using the language of corporate business, who report annually against the UN goals, stakeholders and policymakers won't give events the value they deserve. So start recording, start tracking and start making sure that what you do is valued against those SDGs. And if you're not doing anything that you've heard in this video today, maybe it's time to start.